Hello friends, in this video, we will know about pan and zoom feature. Pan and zoom feature are controlled by the mouse. So to understand this pan and zoom feature, first we have to open up a model. So you select this option for open and then you go to the project files and you can select any of the model. So right now I have saved this model number one or PRT file one and click open. So the model is opened. Now what we have to do is I want to rotate this model or I want to zoom in on to some specific part of this model. For this we have to use the mouse. If we want to zoom in or zoom out, we have to use the roller of the mouse. Suppose I want to zoom in onto this hole. So what we have to do is take the cursor onto this hole and then rotate the roller in the inward direction. When we rotate this, so before rotating we have to click first. So I take the cursor here and then click and then rotate the roller of the mouse. When we rotate it, we can see the model is zooming in and zooming out. Just rotate the roller in reverse direction, it will zoom out. So I zoom in by rotating it inward. So now we can see we are zooming onto this hole. To zoom out, just rotate the roller in the reverse direction. So if we want to zoom in onto this cut feature, I just take the cursor onto this cut feature and then zoom in. Rotate the roller and now it is zooming in. Similarly, we can zoom out from here. Just reverse the roller. In the same way, we can also pan this model. Panning means moving this model left, right and up and down. To use the pan feature, we have to press the shift key from the keyboard. Press the shift key, hold down the roller of the mouse and then drag the mouse. Now we can see when the mouse is dragging, the model is also dragging with it. So we can select the location where we want to position this and then hold off the shift key. If we want to pan it on up and down direction, we have to press the control key from the keyboard, hold down the roller and then drag the mouse. It is zooming up and down. So this way we can use the pan feature. And if we want to rotate this model, to rotate the model, what you have to do is just hold down the roller of the mouse, hold down the roller and drag the mouse. Now we can see with this mouse, the model is rotating. So in this way we can use the pan and zoom feature in the Creo Parametric software.